Hey everybody, it's Andrea and it's Monday the 5th of August. I'm feeling much better as you can tell. Thanks for your wishes. Um, today, me and Jennifer are going out to Newport because she wants to try American waffles. She said this to me last week when I was ill. And I said, well, we can go to Casper's and she can try um, an American waffle. Because we have two types of waffles in the UK. We have the American style, which are obviously a sweet one. And we have what they call potato waffles, which are made of, well, potato. So she wants to try an American waffle with Oreos. She's nodding. So we are just going to get ready and go out and I will see you in Casper's. So we're here in Casper's now, waiting for our food. We've got Diet Coke in glass bottles again. Just be doing around. Jennifer's got my phone. Sadly, her tablet stopped working the other night, so we're waiting for another one to come. What are we watching? Smiling Critters, is it? Or no. Poppy's Playtime? Or? Pop, pop Player Gets Control. Oh. Why him? He put the mask. Oh, the masked man. The yeah, nasty the mask, man. The masked man. Uh huh. So we're just waiting now for our. I'm having my mango mania. I have wait. to have it. I can't wait. You've been waiting for these waffles all week, haven't you? He was asking from last week, and I said as soon as I was well. So here we are has got her waffle. Look at the size of it. It's as big as her head. I've got my mango mania. I love mango mania. So I might have to try a bit of a waffle later. It's yummy, yummy. What do you think so far? So we went into the works and they got thank you box merch. So we've got a. We open the package, right? Yeah, it's a squishy, isn't it? Should we show them? Well, the packaging is in there. Should we open that one up yeah. and see what yeah. figure we got? Oh, is it another bit of packaging? They package it well. Yeah. It's like it. Oh, it's Rocky. Is it Rocky? Cyborg Rocky. Cyborg Rocky. Rocky. Wow, it's really good, heavy material, isn't it? Yeah. That is good quality. Yeah, Sometimes the stuff from... Oh, it, it smells nice? good, it smells good. Oh, I love that smell. Oh yeah, pop it back in its box then and we'll open up the next one. So, usually some of the, the merch from these YouTubers the, is poor quality stuff, but um, like the squishies, not the, the expensive merch, but this the squishies, but that is really good. Let's put that back in there. Okay. Can't wait to show Daddy. Oh, we showed Daddy. He's in a meeting, so we can't show him straight away. You have to be quiet when we get back. Okay. And I'll, I'll put that back in the bag, okay? Yeah. With everything else. And okay. this is a Lankyberg mystery fig. A Lanky box. I can't even say their names. What was Choking hazard. It's just, it's not for children under three. You are six, so you are fine. Put the rubbish in the bag, please, Jeb, when you're finished, okay? Oh. Who have you got? Who is it? It's um this one. It's one of the boxes. This one. Superhero. Superhero Foxy. Where? Hey. Do you want to try and get it out? Yeah. Just... Put that in there. It's fine. Let's throw it away later. And that oh, bit. I can't open it. No. Hang on. Do you want me to do it? Yeah. Say it's very well packaged, which is great. Oh. We have that. It's very big. That is quite big for a, a mystery figure. They're usually really tiny. So. Yeah, you could, Hero Foxy, is it? Yeah, you could get... Lots of them. There's different ones, isn't there? There's a chop. Wow, there's loads. And the, the favourite one is... These ones. Oh. These ones. Well, Jen, next time we come down, maybe you can get another one. This one's set. Wait, where is it? He's on the other side. He's up here. There he is. That one is wet. All right, you happy? Next time you can have another one if they've still got them, all right? I promise. But you put them on your shelf in your bedroom, sweetheart, on no, display. I'm just going to leave them play with them. Well, you can play with them as well. Because, uh... Hey everybody, it's Tuesday and it's Tuesday after, well, late Tuesday afternoon, early evening. Um, I've got to be honest, nothing's happened today. The one thing about having a chest infection and the asthma I've got is that 
Even when I'm over the worst of it, like now, I still get very tired very easily. So literally all I did was a bit of tidying up, I had a shower and fell asleep. Jennifer's downstairs playing games. Um, last night I started reading this book, enjoying it so far. But I'm also trying to get through this book, which I have nearly finished, to be fair. <laughs> After this one, it's Elantris by Brandon Sanson. And then, it's once I've started that one, I can pick the next pile of books I'm going to read. It seems to work for a TBR for me, and I just push in things that I want if I want to. Now, I've got two colouring books today. One was a pre-order, which was... Um, what was it? Maria Trolley's Shooting Star, I think it's called. And the other one is a Halloween book by Adriana Lay, which you will see at the end of the month in the hall. Looking forward to that. We'll also do flip throughs when I get a chance. Um, I'm thinking of doing some shorts and there'll be one minute book reviews. So what do you think? Do you think that's a good idea? Should I do some one minute book reviews like a one minute review of War and Peace, one minute review of It Ends With Us by Colleen Hoover and so on. And just put my thoughts down in a minute. I'm thinking of doing that. What do you think? Is that a good idea? I'm going to pop downstairs now and get some tea for the others because I think they might be hungry. I know I am. Hey everybody, it's Wednesday. Um, not a lot happening. Jennifer wouldn't get dressed and come out with me because I had to go shopping and she doesn't want to come shopping. So I'm going to do it in a bit. I'm going to take it to my mum's. We are planning going out on the weekend. We were supposed to be babysitting, but they've decided to do something with the family instead. Um, they, it's their anniversary. They want to do something with the family, which is fine. So we're going to go to Foman Castle, which is this place I've discovered um, at the other side of... Um, Cardiff. Looks interesting. So we're going to do that on Saturday instead. Um, I've just set up this easel. It's not, hopefully not going to fall off. I can weight it down if I need to but I think it's going to be fine. Um, I'm going to use this for filming. I think it's just going to be easier, not necessarily this book because this book is really heavy. Ah, it's not too bad. Pop the books on there and then I can just open them like that when I'm filming things like my um, flip throughs and wrap up so I am going to film one of those now and see how it goes so I'll let you know afterwards well you will have seen it by then so you'll know but hey you know what I'm like so I've just finished doing all my filming Jennifer's down at quite ta blah, 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 taekwondo um, so I'm just adding some books to my library thing and I've done my filming so I'm happy and I'm just going to go and start editing these, but I'm going to take my laptop downstairs and do it in the comfort of the living room because I'll be putting dinner on very soon for everybody. I, I'm really happy, actually. I've got it all done in one go, which means that I might do some other kind of filming tomorrow because I'm going to want to start doing these one-minute reviews. I know other people do them, but I thought I could, I, I could do them, film it on my phone, and then I can add it to TikTok, I can add it to... YouTube, if it's a Marilyn book, I can add it to Mar my Marilyn TikTok as well as my normal TikTok and my other one. And it's just something I'm going to start doing, so I might do that tomorrow. So I'm going to go and do this now, put these books away, and I'll see you later. It's Friday. Don't want to ask what happened to Thursday, apart from it rained all day. We managed to get her out. She wanted to win a pot, but look at what she's got. Come round here and show them. Got her a dip dab, and this is the second time it's happened. She's got two lollies. A lucky day today, isn't it? Yeah. You got two and I had it. Now I had it two times. You've had it twice, haven't you, that you've had two lollies? At least we had a walk. We got out in the fresh air. She won't go in the park. I don't know what you're afraid of, Jen. There are too many people? Okay. Too many people. Don't like people, do we? No. Nope. Yeah. Sit and eat, eat your thing, aren't you? She's a good girl. It's Saturday afternoon and the rain this morning has turned into a lovely day, hasn't it? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Paul's eating nuts. Crazy. We're at the Prince of Wales, planted a drink. I spoke to my mum and said, or if I don't come down today because me and Paul fancy going out for a pint because we haven't had one for ages, have we, together? No, been ages. He said, no, that's fine, I'll be all right. And I said I'd bring her a bit later, make sure she's okay. I'm on my third pint. First was a Thatcher's and blackcurrant, and now I'm on my second pint of recording. Paul's a drinking of the fabulous Timothy Taylor Landlord. That's a beer that's been around. Sharp's Isn't a sharp glass. It's a beer that's been around for a long time because I used to serve that back in the 90s in the uh, older sizes back in Hitchin in Hertfordshire. Yes, dear. Those were the days. Oh, yeah. Love it. You gotta love it. And there's my baby. She's quite happy, and we're just having a nice 
afternoon chilling out with the pub aren't we? Mm. We, we need it, we deserve it. Paul's being all gorgeous there in the corner. Yes you are, I love you. Anyway. Yeah, Sunday evening, don't know what happened then. Um, yeah, the vlogging hasn't gone very well this week. I'll admit. It's been either raining too much or too hot. Like today, it's like 28 degrees, which is too much for me. I mean, I'm old, so I feel the heat a lot. You know, ladies of a certain age, you know where I'm coming from. Uh, we've spent the day mostly tidying up, which is bad enough because it's hot. So I'm going to go in, have a cold drink and um, have some dinner. Have a shower. Cold shower. We've also changed beds, clean bedding tonight, which is always nice. We have a nice shower and go in clean. Always feels good. I will try and do a bit more. Try and give you a bit of a reading update. Um, so hot. I don't like the heat at all. I'm not going to lie. So I'm going to get out of the car because even the window's open. It's hot. Apparently, our new neighbours are moving in tomorrow. So I heard on it, um, Deb's over the road say, because she used to own number seven. Sorry, number th what is it? Number thirteen, um, which is next door to us, and um, her daughter lived in it, and her daughter moved um, to West Wales, and I heard her tell her her son and his missus um, that they're moving in tomorrow. Apparently, because she said that's what she said. She said that they said to her when when they're moving in. She said tomorrow. So we shall see what happens. The street, by the way, today is rammed. There's hardly a parking space on here. I think there's one more bit further down, that's it. So, um, I've had to park by the telegraph pole. Don't bother me, because nobody's getting in the car. If Jennifer does tomorrow, I'll move it. Hopefully I'll be able to move it and she can get in. So, this is what it is. I'm going to go in now. I'll see you in a bit. So, it's Sunday evening. I am in the other room, which is the room with all my lovely books in it. Um, because we're trying to get Jennifer to sleep in her own room. So, she has been sleeping with me since around the time Grandad died, occasionally before that. But when he, when Badad died, she got extremely clingy and scared that everybody else was going to disappear, which is understandable. She's six. Um, but I'm not sleeping properly because she's constantly right up against me all night long. So we were trying to get her sleep in her other, in her other room. So to do that, Paul's gone into the double bed because she won't go into the bed with him for some reason. Um, and she can't come in this room, it's too small. So, she's got her tablet. I mean, it is getting on, but we're gonna just let her have it tonight, just so that she stays in her room. And uh, uh, fingers crossed, she'll be okay. And we'll get her used to it um, before she goes back to school. Because it'd be better for her, and it'd be better for me. I am now surrounded by my lovely books. Books I've read, books I'm reading, my Hollywood books, my Jack Ripper books, my Egypt books, all my books, all my colouring books, all my Marilyn books. Really. I do love this room. Um, there's a lot of books in here. I'm not going to lie. I'm going to yawn though. Oh, excuse me. Oh dear me. So we just started sorting it out. Um, eventually, hopefully, me and Paul will end up back in the same bed. He does snore very loudly though, and I. I'm a very light sleeper, he's a very deep sleeper, so sometimes I, mm, I can't, he'll wake me up, if he, if he breathes heavy, he'll probably wake me up. So I'm going to sleep in here tonight and we'll see how it goes, I'll let you know next week. I'm hoping to get out and about with her this week, we haven't done much this whole day, just simply because I've been ill and it's either been raining or too hot. <sighs> Anyway, that's it for this week. I'll see you next week.